Yo guys, how's it going? Mad Cass here, and you guys are probably wondering what the hell is this? What the hell is this? This is not the custom map you've been working on. Well, you're right, it isn't. And I'm doing something even more crazier. I'm starting up a new custom map alongside the Ochelon because the Ochelon is taking a lot more time than I expected to even just do little things due to my work schedule and stuff like that. And I, to be honest, I want to work on that behind the scenes so when I release it, you guys get to explore it as if it's brand new to you. So if I keep showing it on YouTube videos and live streams and such like that, you guys are going to know where everything is, what the layout looks like and stuff. And I don't want that. So to keep you guys interested, this new map, this is going to be a community challenge map. And now you're probably thinking, what the hell does that mean? Well, this room here, this is a blank canvas room. Now, this room needs fleshed out, as you can see. But the whole idea of this is I am going to make different no sorry i've already made a prefab of this room that i will be sending to mappers who are willing to participate in this challenge so the whole idea is we have a room we have three windows and literally when it comes to making this map you can detail it any way you wish you'll not be able to like to modify anything though you'll not be able to remove these window barriers Rehight the walls. You're not be able to rescale the walls, rescale the floor, but you can bring stuff into it. You can modify. You can add an extra wall into here if you wanted and modify it all the way around to make it look completely different. Square room. You don't even have to keep it a square room, but you must keep to these boundaries. Now that is what I'm saying. You've got to keep everything to the boundaries. And now I'm going to send this to mappers who are good in the community. I want you guys to let me know how good you are at mapping. And I will give you this prefab and you can be part of this community challenge. There's going to be 10 rooms in this map and it will be simply as follows. So we have the starting room down here, which I'm going to work on. This is going to be my room, which I need to fill out, detail it, make it look like it's some sort of cool room. I still haven't thought of an idea what it's going to look like yet, but I will get working on that pretty soon. I made a live stream on that. But yeah, the idea of this is you will survive in the first room until round 10 and this door will open up to allow you to go to the next room also down here in this room like i say we've got three spawn rooms for zombies detail them how you wish detail them up like i say do not modify the exterior walls but you can add extra walls on the inside and stuff like that just to keep the dimensions all like legit so i can actually add these together and make it look pretty cool so you have your three wall by uh, sorry your three zombie spawn areas right there this little alcove bit will be where a perk machine is stored. Do not change the location of the perk machine on your map if you are selected for this. You can remove these walls once you've put your perk machine there. You can modify the walls. You can break the walls. Do not modify the outside walls. That is, I've got to stress that. Do not modify the outside walls or the ceilings. You can modify the internal parts, but not the outside dimensions. So yeah, once you reach round 10, this door will open and you will get to go up these stairs. Once you make your way to the top of these stairs, that door will shut behind you. You will be no longer able to go into that room. And then you will enter this room, which another map out will take control of, and they will make it into their scale of the room. So you'll have similar room like this, whatever the map has decided to do, it will always have the three window spawns right there, and the area for the perk machine. They may choose to add some wall weapons in here if they really want to, but I probably will be adjusting that to suit the difficulty of this map. And once again, in this room, you will survive. 10 rounds and then you will open up this door here which will then take you up the stairs one more time to another room which will be a duplicated copy of this prefab which another mapper will work on so the whole idea is it's kind of like a tower building you start off on the bottom room which i will create i will detail this out make it look awesome into something cool i may make it look like an ancient temple or something like that and then i'll see you complete round 10 that door opens up and we go upstairs to another room which another mapper has created and so on and so forth and the whole idea is you won't be able to go back down there so whatever you leave down there whatever perks you leave down there you will not be able to get now like i said there is going to be at least 10 rooms in this so imagine that you've got to survive to round 100 or may make it that less i may make it five rooms i'll decide how many mappers get involved in this anyway but yeah once we get to the very very top floor of the map pack a punch will open once you complete the final round and all the doors to the previous rooms will also open up as well so there you go, that is the idea what I've got in mind for a community challenge map. Basically, the whole idea of the community is we get some mappers who are interested into this and can actually do some really, really good mapping work and I'll give them the prefab 
for this room layout along with the stairs because the stairs are going to be part of your room as well so you need to detail the stairs out as well these are just like literally the prefab of the stairs you cannot modify them you can texture them you can add different things just like the room down here as well you can texture it add different things add extra walls reshape it to your liking but do not modify the outside bounding walls so there you go that is it i'm going to be looking for at least uh between five and ten mappers to take on this if you are interested in this and you have got great mapping skills and have actually showed some competency when you've been doing maps and showcase it send me some links to your images send me some videos to your maps and i will select a few people to be part of this i'm already going to send this out to a few people who are in the mapping community already to get this project started and i think it'd be pretty cool it's kind of like a one room challenge but you literally once you get out of the one room you go up to the next room and everything hopefully if it works out fine everybody should have a completely different looking room so no area will look the same granted the size may be similar but if we work on this really really good like i say it's not too big of a room to detail out you can bring the walls in you can add walls in you can add obstacles and stuff like that i haven't made any second floor areas into this but that's why when you complete it you go up to the next area so there you go guys that is what this is going to be this is going to be a community challenge map and literally I think it'll be awesome if we get all the awesome app as involved in this. If you are good at map and want to be part of this, please leave a comment down below with links to your maps and stuff like that. And let me know what you think of this. Do you think this is a good idea to bring the community together to bring us back into Black Ops 3 and the zombie community? Because it seems to be dead at the moment and I want to try and inject a little bit more life into this. And I expect this shouldn't take too long if everybody works on their own map and area individually then send it back to me and i will literally drop it in place it add the doors add the zones and spawns and we will have an awesome community map but there you go guys that's all i want to show you for today i'm going to be working on over the next few days this area my starting area and i will send it out the, to the other mappers let me know what you think show me your work in the in the comment section down below and i may pick you to test this out but yeah i'd be mad guys if you did like this video hit that like button comment down below what you think and if you are new to the channel please subscribe and continue to dropkick your grandma